Good morning, everyone. So tired. Our fire um, alarm was going off at 2 a.m. Yeah, for no so reason. it rang, I think, four times. And I, I woke up, the first time I rang, I woke up in pa she was like, panic. I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna die, this is fire. And then it kept going, and then Barry was getting stressed out, so. It was sad. This is us on like three hours of sleep or something. I don't know how my long we slept. My head is pounding. Literally woke up feeling hungover today, but we're still gonna film our video. My parents are coming into town today. They should probably be here within the hour. Um, so we're gonna film what, eat, what we eat in day, what we eat in a day today. And then also just vlog what we're doing. Um, we'll probably go patio furniture shopping. So I guess we'll vlog that too. I don't really know. I'm very excited. Starting my day with uh, my green juice. I've heard about this a bunch, but it's basically a green juice powder you put into water and then you drink it. And I have a coffee over there. I'm probably gonna make a matcha at some point, but I don't know. I just felt like I needed to drink water because my head was hurting so bad. I need to drink more water. Um, yeah, so I'll show you guys what we eat for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. We're actually going to a friend's house for dinner, Caitlin. Um, and then for breakfast, I'm not, I don't really have a plan yet. I know what we're making for lunch, though. We don't really eat breakfast too much. Well, I want breakfast today. Okay. I've been eating breakfast. I don't think you, you eat have. breakfast. Yeah. So, I'll show you what we eat when we eat something next. But I just wanted to open this video before I forget. <laughs> All right. Let's do this. So matcha latte make this all our what I eat in a day is basically, but if you're new here, I'm gonna make it. Basically I get some warmed plant milk of your choice. Today I'm using oat milk. Put that in a blender. Make sure there's a drip everywhere. Then I get some fresh dates. And if they're not, um, if they are not, what's the word, gooey and soft, then I suggest warming this up with the almond milk or whatever plant milk you're using. Um, because obviously you have to warm it to make a latte, unless you want to make an iced one. But I wanted a warm drink. I usually drink it warm. Then matcha. So the best, okay. And then matcha. So when you're buying matcha powder for your lattes, um, I suggest buying ceremonial grade matcha versus culinary grade matcha. It's much more high quality and you really taste the difference. Culinary grade you use to make matcha muffins and whatever you're gonna use to cook with matcha and um, the ceremonial grade is for lattes and drinking. The brand that I use is The Reserve. Um, I'll link them down below if you wanna check them out. Not affiliated with them, bought this with my own money. I love this matcha. I've tried a couple brands and I am sticking with this one because it's really good. Um, so basically you add your matcha, your milk, and your dates into a high speed blender and you blend that until smooth and it gets frothy. And that is it. You got yourself a homemade matcha latte. It just takes three ingredients and it's really good. All right, blended. You just gotta pour it into your cup. You can see, maybe. Can you see? I don't want to pour it onto the counter. All right, here's the froth. Chris is watching, I don't know what the hell he's watching, so that's what you're hearing in the background. It's nice and frothy, it's warm, and it's actually perfect today, so. So cheers. On this guy. All right, time to make lunch. Mom, can you come say hi? My parents got here. Come on, you wanna say hi too? What's wrong? Say hi. There. Everybody's here. Say We're having hello. a family day, and I'm gonna make my parents some lunch. Hey. Okay. All right. I'm gonna take them away so, so he doesn't bother you. For lunch, we Bye. got <laughs> purple Careful. carrot. We are partnering up with Purple Carrot for this video. Shout out to them for sponsoring today's video. And if you haven't heard of Purple Carrot, they are a meal delivery service and. I like them because instead of just getting food, sticking it in the microwave and enjoying it, you actually get the whole experience of cooking the recipe and I feel like that makes it more enjoyable. They send a booklet with their packages as well and that way you have the full recipe in front of you so if you want to remake the recipe in the future, you totally can. Purple carrot is something I recommend to those of you who are newly vegan or vegan curious and want to eat more plants because you can try out new recipes and they are basically foolproof. All of them are so easy. We have had purple carrot meals for 
maybe a year, even longer now, and all of them have been delicious, easy, and I highly recommend it. So, and one more thing I wanna mention, Purple Carrot now offers six serving meals, so it's great for large families, it's great for meal prepping in our case, it's also great when your parents come into town. So, I'm gonna be putting this together, I'll show you guys the process, and then I will also show you the end result, obviously. And also, I forgot to mention, if you want $30 off your first Purple Carrot order, I have a discount code down below for you guys to check out. So, let's get started. Here is the final shot. I hope you can see my face. <laughs> this is scary. And I'm also going to put my hands in it, try to figure out what looks best, but I really like how this turned out. Oh, my mom's calling. Hi, mom. Literally everyone <laughs> left. Chris went to band practice. Um, he's gonna eat when he gets home, and then my parents were like, you're taking too long, and they wanted to go to Trader Joe's, so. They're there while I prepared all this, and I was like, it's gonna take a little while because I really wanna shoot nice photos, and my parents understand. We used to live with them, and it's it's really funny. When we go out to eat with my parents, they'll get their food, and they'll be like, oh, okay. They'll just stand there and wait. They're like, oh, do you wanna take photos of our food too? It's so funny. So they, they totally get it. My mom wanted to go to Trader Joe's anyways. So now I'm gonna eat this. This is so good, and it's so easy. So the direction said to add the peppers to your liking and I don't really cook with Thai chilies often so I didn't really know how many I should put so I ended up putting half of the Thai chilies into it and I thought it was really spicy but once I mixed everything together and got the sauce all over everything it's actually not bad and it's really good. I'm gonna keep making this. My parents are gonna love it. So this is what we're having for lunch. Also I forgot to mention during that, I'll just get, during the cooking process, I got hungry, but I was filming, and it was, I, I already had the camera all set up, so I had a banana, um, in case you were wondering. We decided that since we woke up really late, I would just make lunch, but it did take a little while, so Chris ended up leaving. I don't know if he ate anything, but he might be eating something at band practice, I'll ask him, but I hope he'll eat some of this when he gets home, but I guess if he doesn't, it's fine, because... We can just eat it tomorrow. Okay, so I'm gonna finish this deliciousness. And my parents are on their way back. They're probably gonna eat when they get here. And then we're gonna go hang out in Portland for the day. Yeah, 
I feel weird eating to you guys like this, so I'll see you soon. We got Grill Master Dan in the house. Scary, you ready? Yeah. You ready, girl? Oh. <laughs> those burgers down here. Yeah. yeah. Oh, man. Load it up, Vin. Just trying to... Uh... Vin's making another appearance from the vegan chicken taste test video. We've got our dogs ready. Here we go. We've got the dogs. We're the dogs. Not for you, honey. We also got some Beyond Burgers, mustard and some Yoko's cheese. We took a little trip into Portland, probably gonna go to a thrift store. Um, I'm with my parents. Um, but my dad loves this place here called Dinger's Deli. It's a sandwich spot. So we're gonna have second lunch and we're gonna head there and pick up some subs. And I don't know if we're gonna go, I don't know where we're gonna go after this, but yeah, we're just spending the day here, so. I don't know what Chris is doing. I asked him to please vlog while he's at band practice. So hopefully he has some footage for you guys. And if so, you guys should be seeing it in this video. So I wasn't planning on getting anything, but I caved and I'm just gonna take whatever I don't finish to go. Vegan Cuban, and then my parents both got vegan Philly cheesesteaks. My parents are napping, I can't be too loud. I just took a little bit of a nap myself. Making the same brownies that I made in our Chris's birthday video, it's a um, double chocolate brownie mix from Safe and Fair. And um, we're going to Caitlin's house for dinner tonight. And she asked me to bring dessert. And honestly, I don't have time to make a dessert from scratch because it is 5.30 and we're supposed to be there at, she said between 6 and 6.30, so I need to hurry my booty up. But I'm just gonna make these brownies and I like them because they're also gluten free and her and her boyfriend are gluten free. So, yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. I don't know what dinner's gonna be like, but I'm excited to see everyone and hang out. When Caitlin lived here, we, I mean, obviously we saw her every day and we also, used to hang out with our friends a lot more. We have friends that live like literally five minutes away from us in another neighborhood, which is great. But since she moved and since all our friends have been traveling, it's been hard to get everyone together. And even now, like one of our friends is out of town, so we're still gonna be missing someone, but it's gonna be fun. My parents are coming too. So we're gonna hang out, uh, eat some vegan food, probably have a beer or two, and then eat some brownies. Yeah, I'm gonna mix this. I'm so tired. I barely ate like, I didn't even eat half of my sandwich because I was full and I just took the rest home. We're gonna eat it probably tomorrow, but. Oh, Chris is home. Those noodles freaking filled me up. They're so good. There's leftovers for Chris to try, but. Um, yeah, mix in this mix. I don't know what to talk about right now. I feel so I feel so out of it. I just woke up. Oh, I know what this. Oh my gosh, it's so washed out. The subtle art of not giving a fuck. You can kind of see that. I don't know why it's not showing on the camera, but the guy shares his perspective on life and basically tells you to stop giving a fuck about things that don't pertain to your life and stop putting your energy into uh, things that aren't not going to serve you basically really inspiring book um it took me a while to get through it but i just did an audiobook and i listened to that when i'm cooking and cleaning and whatever here he is conscious chris in the house i was wondering why this mix is so dry but i forgot to put oil in it do you think i should put applesauce instead of oil or i'm scared Maybe I could do half and half. Yeah, so I'll do half and half, because I don't want to, it's half a cup of oil. What up, y'all? How was your uh, boys' day? It was nice. We had fun. Boys' day. Got some work done on a new song. Nice. That's good, right? Yeah. Oh, Sam. 
Oh, I don't know. My mom got something. Chips. My mom is classic. My mom. She comes. So I told her, Caitlin's. Oh yeah, in the fridge. So Caitlin is making dinner, and she just asked us to bring dessert. And so I told my mom, and then like she goes to Trader Joe's, and she comes. She's like, okay, I got these jackfruit. The jackfruit crab cakes from Trader Joe's. She's like, I got the jackfruit crab cakes. I'm gonna bring this and this. She's like, should I make um, rice pilaf? I'm like, Mom, Caitlin's cooking dinner. <laughs> that's amazing. Yeah, that's great. Hi. No, it's good. Everything's God's Peach. Chili cheese. Everything's good. Caitlin's everything's chili. important. She also made everything bagel okay. potato salad and the everything bagel potato salad. Salad. Everything bagel. Broccoli thing. What is this? I mean, broccoli salad. Oh, it's a broccoli salad. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my mom made the Trader Joe's crab cakes, we made some homemade tartar sauce, got some lemon. We have to make phone calls somehow. Oh, I'm happy too. I'm so happy I was here at the same time. It's brownies. How are they? They're actually way better this time. Yeah? <laughs> Chris is brownie number two. Boom. <laughs> we recorded the whole outro and it didn't even record, so that's good. Thank you, technology. We really appreciate you. Uh, I was about to just go to bed, but Chris was like, let's check. Um, Always got to check. Thank you guys for watching. I got super stuffy when I got home. I don't know why. You could blow your nose on my shirt if you'd like. Okay. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Come in with us again sometime. <laughs> Um, what is this? My knee. Oh. Uh, what was I going to say? Oh, we forgot the camera at Caitlin, so it was, we weren't able to vlog a lot, but we just used Chris's phone and it worked out. I hope you guys enjoyed what you saw. We just basically had chili dogs and sides. So Summer many food. dogs today. You Scary, had a lot. Scary, Lily. God, I love uh, them all. I don't, was Lily in our video? Mm -hmm. uh, she's so sweet. <laughs> um, anyways, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you check out Purple Carrot. Link down below for thirty dollars off your They're first bomb. order. I can't wait to eat that tomorrow. There are still two, yeah, two servings left. So, oh no, three, because there's yeah, three servings. How many? Left. All three servings. I don't think so. I don't want them. Um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe below. Come back and hang. Comment and say hey. We always um, love to hear from you. Yeah. We'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Bye.